Yes, sir. Grand Rising to all. It's your boy Terrence Carter. Hey, and I'm here, back at it again. Yes, sir. All praise to the Most High God for another day of life. Happy Saturday to everybody. I feel amazing. It's legitimately five degrees out here today in New York. That's wild. That is extremely wild, bro. Like they really done broke the weather machine for real. <laughs> Not even go for it. But I feel real good. Today's video, I want to talk to you guys on your semen retention and your no fap experience, your journey, the powerful journey, man. I want to talk about three. I'll give y'all three reasons as to why you need, you need to maintain a long streak, right? You need to retain your seed for long periods, especially if you just started out on retention, bro. Or even if you passed two months, three months, four months, you need to keep on retaining, bro. This is really, really powerful. So I want to talk about that in today's video. I want to say thank you to everybody that's still been supporting the channel. If this is your first time to the channel, all I ask is that you hit the subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up so that we do get these videos on the algorithm and we reach more people. Um, a huge thank you, of course, to everybody, like I said, that continues to support the channel. And everybody that's on their retention and no fat journey, keep on staying focused, bro. Keep on staying tunnel vision. Now, I got my notes right here. And I'm super duper like, I got so much energy, bro. Like, I, bro, I got so much energy. All jokes aside, bro, I, I really love this experience. Like, you really wake up feeling amazing. And just like I said, like, it's legitimately five degrees today. The average person is not going to want to go out there and work. Go <laughs> to stay home, watch Netflix, watch TV, chill. It's Saturday. Me, I'm about to go feed people. Real talk. First reason why you need to maintain these long streaks on semen retention, bro. Ah, oh, man, you are learning yourself. You are legitimately learning who you really, truly are, bro. You know how good it feels to feel good? To have mental clarity, to feel purified? To live in your higher self. To learn who you truly are. You know how good that feels? First thing that I used to do was watch people have fornication on the screen when I first woke up in the rising. And I would do that to start my day. Before I even go out there in the real world. And when you think about it, right? When you think about it from the from looking at it at the outside in, it's like, why was I programmed to start my days with watching PORN? Get on semen retention and no fat, you're gonna start your days off working out, thanking God early in the rising. Figuring out how you about to go out there and conquer your day. How you going to value your time. You know how much time and energy you put into watching porn? Before you even watch the video, you know how much time and energy it takes for you. Your brain get that, that image in your head. Your body get that rush automatically, bro. Your body gets the rush before you even watch the video. And then you got to take that energy and go into your, onto your laptop or on your phone, type in the internet site, go scroll looking for the video, find the video. After you find the video, you then fast forward to your favorite part so that you could get yours off. Do you understand how bad that is for humanity? You understand how bad that is for your spirit? 
Maybe that's why I was so angry as a teenager. I was so angry in my early 20s because I didn't have no type of self-control. I didn't have no type of knowledge of self. I wasn't really learning myself. But this is why I, I'm so forgiveful, forgiveful of myself. I be forgiving myself and I forgive those that have hurt me because they didn't know no better and I didn't know no better. I was hurting myself. So of course people gonna hurt me with their words. Of course people gonna try to destroy my self-confidence because I was doing it to myself. If you don't see my attention to no fact, you're gonna respect yourself a lot more. You're gonna love yourself a lot more. You're gonna embrace yourself a lot more. You're gonna heal yourself and people will feed off of that energy. <laughs> you need to maintain on this experience because you are literally taking your your power back. You are literally controlling yourself. You can self-destruct in this reality, but you can also heal yourself and take care of yourself in this reality as well. It's real talk. Number two reason why you need to maintain a long streak on semen retention and no fat. It's that you got to take the time out to unlearn and then relearn. Unlearn and then relearn. Because everything that was taught to us was a lie, bro. It's not true. They tell us we have 24 hours in a day, but yet all we have is the present moment. That's all we have. It's literally all we have is the present. Doctors tell you that releasing you, release your energy, Rele release your seed. It's healthy for you, my boy. It's, it's healthy. It's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong with releasing it, releasing the life force energy that God has given to me. There's, there's nothing wrong with that. But why do they lie to us, bro? There's everything wrong with that. What you need to do as a man is retain your seed. Protect your energy. Get that it's it's your it's your armor it's your protection do you bro like this is why they're not gonna ever teach this in schools bro they they probably will never ever teach this knowledge in school because schools keep you trapped they think that you a grade in school bro that's it You get an A, you get a B, you get a C, you get a D, or an F. Some people graduate, some people drop out of school. But do they teach you about the real world? Do they teach you about mental health, spiritual growth, spiritual healing? Are they teaching, them, teaching you that in school? No. Teaching you how to tap in on your, on your real power, on the spirit. On the spirit. So once again, you got to unlearn and relearn. When I say relearn, you need to teach yourself the things that that help you. You need to learn how to believe in yourself. Because they're not going to teach you in school how to believe in yourself. How to build self-confidence. How to uplift your spirit. Say good things to yourself. Affirm good things to yourself. Pour it into your cup. Protect your energy. Protect your mind. Protect your spirit. Learn how to add value to the world. The more that you are working and improving on yourself and becoming your best version, you are adding value to the world because you are being the best you. So now you're presenting that into the world. You're presenting that to yourself. You're fixing yourself. You're healing yourself. I've been healing myself on semen retention, no fat. I've been fixing myself, bro. All the anger, all the rage, all the punch of holes in the wall, all, all that stuff is low vibration, low energy. That stuff, though, that stuff wasn't getting me nowhere. But mad at myself. 
But like I said, being no senior attention to no fat has given me the power, the ability to literally heal myself every day. Y'all can see it in my eyes, bro. My eyes be white. My face be clear. I just be feeling so pure. And every day I ask God, how how can I help more people? In any way, shape, or form, how, how can I help more people? Because the more people that I help personally, the more that I help myself. Unlearning and relearning this reality. You don't need porn. You don't need to bleach your seed. You don't need none of that. That was a lie that people have told you. Stop listening to that stuff. You don't need it. You need to retain your seed, bruh. Learn life. Third reason why you need to maintain the long street. Maintain it, bro. Keep going. Keep pushing back. Oh, man, bro. Spiritual connection. Spiritual connection. You're connected to the source. You're not feeling disconnected. You will really feel connected to source. You are source. The higher power. Infinite being. We got infinite potential. Infinite intelligence. All within us. You tapped in on that side of you now. I could create a better reality just with my sexual energy, just with self discipline and self awareness. This is a real powerful experience. I wouldn't be talking about it if it wasn't powerful. I wouldn't waste my time talking about this. I'm living this experience every single day, bro. My inner child is proud of me for taking my power back. The adult version of me, Terrence Carter, I'm very, very happy with myself. Spirit, the spiritual connection is very powerful. <laughs> All it takes is for you to really tap in on that. Tap in on. Just tap in on the real you. It's nothing that's really stopping you. You can't live in lust 24-7, bro. You can't be that person. That's trash. That's not going to ever help you really conquer yourself. Sex isn't going anywhere, bro. That shouldn't be the only thing that you focus on in life. Focus on building a better, positive self, like respect for yourself. Focus on building a better, positive life, a better, positive routine, better, positive habits, better, positive system internally. I learned that in the book, Atomic Habits, <laughs> that we create we have goals set out for ourselves as human beings, but in order to reach those goals, we need to have better systems. If you create a better system for yourself and you do things the right way, you can conquer your goals and you can literally create a better life. So that's what I'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis, creating a better system, better routines. <laughs> what you focus on grows. All I'm focusing on is growing internally. External world is never going to change if you don't change internally. The best feeling in the world is change. It might feel uncomfortable. It might feel like, damn. Your ego might be like, oh, we got to get used to this change. Yeah. Listen, man, sometimes your ego might get a little bit prideful. Might feel a little bit different. It feel a little bit uncomfortable. Because your ego just want to stay the same. That's not what it's about. Right? Your spirit knows that you need to change for the better. So grow that spiritual connection, man. You are a spiritual being having this human experience. When you learn to serve your soul's purpose, it feels a thousand times better. 
Unlearn, relearn. Unlearn, relearn. Learn yourself, master yourself. And grow that spiritual connection. Keep on retaining your seed, man. Keep on going. You've come too far to ever look back. Take it one day at a time. Keep healing. Keep on improving. Like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate everybody. This is your first time to the channel. Please subscribe to the channel. Appreciate y'all. It's your boy Terrence Carter. Yes, sir.